Theme song. 2.0. The get is Uh, this is, um, a odd game. And I really like Game Boy Advance is weird because, like, they could have done amazing 2D games, but instead they went all this trouble of trying to look 3D and then just. Much like Game Boy being unbelievably shitty 2D, they became unbelievably shitty 3D. Yeah. Grunty sounds like something a Glaswegian would call oral sex. I'm gonna give my lady a grunty, Aaron. Oh, my lady, would you enjoy yes. a grunty? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, grunty. Oh, oh. That's what I sound like. Ah, it's fucking. I feel like I'm being represented. Big dog looking for a granny. <laughs> Grunty. <laughs> oh, that's a lovely bit of Mr. So this Grunty. This is that. an alternative sort of what if bit of Banjo Tooie. Really? Yeah. Huh. What an interesting tack to take. I like that. I don't know what that noise is, but it's fantastic. Mumbo jumbo. Fair enough. It's like he's peeking behind the bush. <laughs> It's weird that for like a handheld that existed for like three years or so, the fucking Game Boy Advance really does have such an insanely distinct aesthetic to half its games. I think it was much longer than three years. It probably was. I was just I just pulled a number out of my bum hole. Fair enough. Probably something insane. Like, yeah. yeah, it's still it's still technically supported. Yeah. Game's still being made for it. <laughs> I believe it. Yeah. Who doesn't want a good grunty blast? Cyber grunty. Yeah. Everyone knows a bear is pretty useless if it doesn't have a bird for backup. I could probably do that with like one of those, um, oh, what are they called? Ibis? Fucking harpy eagles. Uh. They're like bigger than a toddler. I reckon I they could take a toddler. I was to you. Uh. <laughs> that worked. I just need like a tape of that that goes for like 10 hours of just that. Just fucking what, eagle, mumbo jumbo's, yeah, just mumbo eagle. jumbo's dialogue. I wonder if I taught an AI, if I fed it enough mumbo jumbo, yep, yep, if yep, it could yep, talk yep, like yep, that yep. for just, you know, If everything. it could fashion a real functional language. Yeah. Hey! That fucking witch stole me bird. This is great. Yeah, we're going back in time. Uh, jumping straight into the time travel MacGuffins. This was on the Game Boy Advance. <laughs> you were playing on a screen like tiny. About as big as a thumb. <laughs> what the fuck ground monkey are you? Is that like Senile Mr. Rossetti? He's a uh, bottle's ancestor. So I didn't play a lot of fucking whatever it's called. Animal Crossing. Butthole Kablooey. Or Animal Crossing, really. I haven't, I haven't played any Animal Crossing. I don't even know what the fuck the game part of that game is. I think it's just a way for depressed gays and furries to feel responsibility. <laughs> fuck, that's awful. That, that noise is awful. Younger bunga noise was great, but that was uh, two people covered in glad wrap fucking. Ah. Don't talk to him anymore, Aaron. That's for sure. Yes. Don't want me to? No. I, I can't get you yet. Oh, yeah, this is that weird rare world where everything's alive. Yeah, Regardless I don't think I could horrifying. eat my dinner if it had eyes. Like just looking at me, blinking. Hello, Aaron. Punch Hello, Ginger. me. Punch me. Give me a grunty. <laughs> Give your dinner a grunty. Grunty for din dins, Aaron. Ah. I have a rule. Don't give your dinner grunties. Fine. What if it's a watermelon? No. What if it's a, it's a slice of watermelon, still though, eating Alan. it. Yeah, that's a grunty. Oh, no, I yeah. don't want to eat it. You get the tongue involved? No. I don't want to, to fucking you. talk to a statue, you sent a whole piece of shit. Oh, oh, oh. Get your lips moving independently. Alright. 
Oh, that's a collectible. Okay. Yeah. Jinjo. That sounds like a racism. I feel like Jinjo is something you could say to an Aborigine and they'd know immediately that you just said something racist, even if they didn't know what the fuck a Jinjo was. Hey, uh, look at Fucking Jinjos. This is kind of what I love about slurs, is because it really, you can just make them out of anything, provided the intent's there. Uh, I'll watch it, you pancake. Uh, fucking Cody's Cordials coming in here and taking the jobs. <laughs> Jesus. I like that for five seconds, now it's all just the worst noise. I still like Unga Bunga. It sounds like if you really slowed down women's tennis. <laughs> I can hear it. You hear it, yeah. A grunty for you. You don't want to go out to a Nala or a Jinjo will rob you. Oh, you can't climb that. That's why he has a fry pan, isn't it? His backpack. Ah. Bonka has a frying pan. Oh, yeah. Got Conker working recently, and that was nice. Bit of an uphill battle. I posted a tweet about it because it's really fucking weird, and I haven't found anything on any of the RetroArc forums about it. But if you're having trouble getting the Moopin 64 Plus Next uh, <laughs> Core, yeah, I know. To, I love um, it. Now there's Mednafin as well, which is my emulator doesn't need some kind of name or some shit. Like, it doesn't need a fancy name. Um, but yeah, you, if, if you're using Moopin 64 plus next which is supposed to be a really good core and you're getting really bad frames on it even <laughs> though you have like an actual computer um turn vsync off i don't know why but vsync just fucks it up fiddling around turn vsync off and now suddenly i've got the core working properly and it looks great and everything's good you get some decent like fucking it does like frame rate stabilization really well mm. so you know how like some 64 games will drop down to the 24s and shit yeah none of that that's nice yeah and i Really, really actually fucking improves situations. Oh, there you go, you can just smash the cunt. What does that mean? You stop it on the honeycomb you want. Oh, okay. Fills it up. Oh, right, okay, I didn't know what the fuck was going on there. This is hentai erupting out of the ground. That's really rare in a nutshell. Eyes and hentai. <laughs> Sometimes the hentai watches you. You ever seen a hentai that watches you? A bizarre backwards universe when cute anime girls rub one out to be sitting watching TV. That's a weird thought. Don't fight it, Aaron. Aaron. Yum. All right, the enemy's regen. So what's the goal here? Like, what are you I trying need to... to get... The Jinjo statue wants me to get the Jinjos. Okay, there's the little purple buggers, isn't it? Up there, yeah, I haven't got up there. And, oh, well, fuck. And the, um... I need to get a jigsaw piece again in the temple. Oh, there's a jigsaw piece. Where did I go now? Go to the right. So I feel like that bridge, you might... Oh, you can whack him. I don't need him. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's a health up, isn't it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, the honeycomb's health. And, uh... I think I'd, by the time this had come out, is there no button that gets you up that fucking... Nope. Oh. Alright. By the time this had come out, I'd just kind of gotten a bit worn out on fucking exploration platformers. My brother played through it and thought well of it. I thought it was a very good translation, like, for the hardware. Oh, I don't mean this specific, like, uh, version on, of it. Yeah. yeah. I'm, so, I'm safe for this. Yeah, no, I don't need to fucking advice how to whack. Look, I got whacked down. Sounds like Down Syndrome Cantonese. Oh, wow. I don't hear that ever. I'm going to talk to you again. Yeah, see what fucking jelly... Yeah, I know. <laughs> I know. To the south. All right. I know, but yeah, we need the jigsaw piece to get in. Okay. That's what we're trying to find. There isn't a jigsaw piece on the ground that you can interact with in some way? Can you whack it? This reminds me of Day of the Tentacle. It's a good game. Actually, you might be right. See, you know, generally you step step on this and then interact and you put it in. Okay. So, yeah. Hey! But in this game, completely different. <laughs> so. 
Because the problem is you stand on it when you see when you get close. Yeah. And it's that says appears. Zero one, so you're like, yeah. oh, zero one. Oh, I don't have it. Yeah. So. That's the freebie one. Jiggy wiggy. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm going to take your shit. Jesus. <laughs> He's got three syllables. That's just gonna be my inner monologue for like the next week. I could become a DJ with res sounds. Please do. I wanna. You can get anybody to dance to that who isn't aware that that's what they're dancing to. Like if you can get them to just enjoy that as an experience and not like pay some internet girl to like fucking dance to the goddamn. Because you could do that easily. That's, that's, Pitbull that's not does it, so I think I can. If Pitbull can do it, I agree that you can do it. Isn't he, like, really short? Yes. Like, how short? I don't know. I'll look that look up. It up. I want to know his yeah. size. Wait, being, being six foot, it, it is incumbent upon us to make fun of people who are not. Well, you're probably, like, like six one or something, aren't you? Yeah. I used to be six two, but I shrunk slightly. <laughs> It's because of my spine. I got taller. Yeah, he's about 10 centimeters shorter than us. Oh. Damn it. I thought he was really short. I mean, that's noticeable. Like, I mean, it's not like Shakira. She's like 1 meter 57. Oof. Which is like, pretty teensy. Every now and then you get these women that are like four foot and it's like, how do you live? Like... They, what got, if something's mm, up there? They have if, many, many different step ladders, dude. Yeah, like what if something's <laughs> just at my shoulder height, you know? Like, because there was, uh, was one of my journalism classes. There was like some Indonesian girl and she was like, fucking, must have been on the fucking bleeding edge of midget. She was like, no, four foot 11 or four foot 10 or some shit. And maybe 30 kilos when it was raining, you know? And it's like, you can see how some of these girls get abducted. Because you could almost like, have you ever done that thing where you're in a store and you pick up something and you're like, oh, okay, I'll take this to the counter. And you just don't. And you just walk out with it. And nobody stops you. And you realize, I could just keep walking. I could just, I've got this now. This is mine. Yeah. Like, you could almost abduct this woman in that. You could just sort of pick her up to move her out of the way and then just forget to put her down because she doesn't weigh enough to register to your consciousness. I just personally think that the take on me monster is going to get most people. <laughs> That hand the just animated, coming out of the fucking yeah, the yeah. animated universe. Wasn't that a chick or some shit? Like, wasn't I that a love story? Remember. Some dude got sucked into hentai, and then some fucking motorcyclists were like, "Oh, yeah, enough of that queer shit." Exactly. I think of that every time I'm in the shop. I'm gonna get fucking abducted by hands. <laughs> that and Zelda has taught me to fucking fear hands. <laughs> I'd love to have one of those hands just drop down on cunts. Oh, this was it. You had to fucking find music notes to learn how to climb shit. Yeah. Well, at least there's like a progression thing, I suppose. You know, look at that. You look didn't, that. you didn't in the '64 ones because it was 3D. '64 game, yeah. I, I don't know what that's about. I think it's just on the ground. Womp, womp, womp. I did that thing again where I went on a gum tree and looked up fucking. Well, first I looked up gongs, <laughs> and there is a place. Just north of Asplia, actually, it sells gongs, but I don't think they sell ones that I quite want. You know, because some of them are like 200 bucks. I'm like, that's pretty good, but they're still not that big. And I want a big gong. Oh my god, this. Um, so, then I wound up looking up tubers. Because I'd like to have just, you know, it could be a shitty tuba, like a one that a kid took to school and, you know, broken stuff. I just want a, a whole tuba that I can go womp and get a good, <laughs> nice, low tone out of. I think that'd be a lot of fun for me. That'd be a fucking jiggy. Hey. And womp, like as low as possible. Like, is that like a bass tuba? I assume so. A giga tuba. Like, that's what I'd like. I'd like some sort of super bassy tuba. Like, I don't want a high-pitched, twinkly... That sucks. Mm. Eee, that's not what I think when I think tuba, you know. Yeah. Want the meaty power. I want, yeah, I want one of those ones that makes a noise that you can't 
consciously register, but you can feel. Like, you get goosebumps when someone plays it near you. I'd like pop. a tuba that could play the THQ thing. THQ THX. or THX? THX. Yeah. THX. Ooh, just shatter the room, you know? You were standing on a crate. Uh, sure, you yeah. could have got down yourself, you little shit. <laughs> It doesn't need help, but it wants you to help it. it wants to feel big, build big bear arms. I bet he does. Him. Or, or. It wants to be gripped, held. I do love these fucking games where it's like, all right, can I jump up that Ooh. or is that a wall? Yeah. Spect is a little hard. It's a little tricky. It's normally games like this that don't, you know, huh. neat. Actually, pretty nifty. Ninja! All right, well, that was fun. Yeah, it's... For a Game Boy Advance game, it was pretty fucking cool. Also, this farm music is badass. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like fucking, you know, great fucking screaming, you know, metal songs. There's Enter Sandman, and then there's this. I've always had... I think Lars um, could do a pretty good version of this. I think he could. He'd be brilliant. Miss me, bitch. I'm here to steal your notes. You will no longer have the joy of music. Long, long time ago, Don McLean remembered Wap. when a bear stole his pie. Possum stole my pie once. That's funny. Yeah. What sort of possum? Like a... Like a... Like a night one or a day one? Oh yeah, fat orange Australian possum. Okay. Like we were cooling, well not cooling, we were doing the opposite actually. We were defrosting a frozen Sara Lee blueberry pie on the fucking kitchen counter and we had been smoking weed, so we were all really excited for this pie. Let's kill him. Yeah, I was gonna, but the fucking, they are talking shit. Give me your fucking jiggy. Yeah, no worries. <clears throat> yeah, I will. Who ate it? Who shouted out? <laughs> and so we fucking come upstairs thinking, all right, the pie will be pretty defrosted. We could like plug it into the oven and then have fucking pie in a little while, like 15 minutes. And we, we bought cream and everything. It was fucking a brilliant plan. We're high. So <laughs> fucking blueberry pie was just like, this was the evening. Yeah. This was, you know, it's a big deal. And we go upstairs and this possum just looks up and the whole pie is in its mouth. It's not like it's just nibbled a little bit and then like share and share alike. Just the whole fucking pie. Excellent. And I ran off with it. And a friend of mine, Colin, because it was his house and he was, he took losing the pie a lot harder than the rest of us, which is saying something because none of us took the losing the pie well. <laughs> and but like once the possum had escaped into a tree and had the pie in its hands and was eating it, we were like, well, that's it. The pie is gone. Not to Colin. Colin chucked a few fucking things out, including a potato masher, but none of it got close enough, and the, the thing was just looking at him, you know, going, I've got your fucking pie. Fuck off, Gruntweed. <laughs> What's called, cool, dude? Gruntweed. <laughs> There's one of them. Oh, platform game, collect some shit. Always chickens, bro. Oh, my cuckoos have run away. Do you have to, do you have Even to chase the chicken? Even though I'm fucking allergic to them. You, like, dive there? There's air bubbles or water bubbles? You shitty butt. So you're thinking, though. Yeah. I mean, I'm aware that there was, like, discharge from the fucking water wheel. But, like, I figured also just, like... If there's bubbles bubbling up, it means there's a, a hiddenness. Yeah, you never depths. know. Just like me. Yeah, oh. It bubbles up from you as farts and they hurt my <laughs> nose. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. And those <laughs> barrels are empty. I'm gonna hop in them. That's what I thought you could do. Oh, shit. Is there a shrinky barrel? Nah, I'm gonna have to go find Mumbo oh, Jumbo. Sucked. What the fuck is this? What the fuck?
Okay. Oh, okay. Like a hand thing. This is exactly how that fucking little kid sticky handed the five dollar note. Oh, they're scooching, Aaron. They're scooching. Yeah, scooch that, Jimmy. I want to cancel my cast. Come on. <laughs> Big fat one. Come on. Yeah. Oh. Sneaky bum. Damn it. Shit. Aaron, come on. Brian. Well, tits. Tits. No. You shit whore. <laughs> <laughs> That sounds kind of like if you've ever heard an emu talk. You're weird. It's a weirdly good impression of an emu I can manage there. Yeah. <laughs> that is fucking uncanny. I don't like it. Stop it. Can't class this trait. I don't know what I'm saying in emu. I'm basically just doing the ching chong ching chong of talking in emu language. It should be racist, but like, you know, they won the emu war, so technically I'm punching up. All right, all right, all right. Now we're fucking cooking with sheep. I believe it's called lamb. I mean, props to the game for at least trying, like, to chuck some extra shit in there. All right, you can't graze the bottoms. Ah, oh, that's bullshit. Uh, Aaron, no. Oh, Aaron, failure, Gabe. No. Oh, 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 oh. The hand oh, shouldn't oh. Just, Did you fart? No. Okay. Um, no, yeah, I lied. Maybe I did. You did? You fuck. <laughs> I think I just right. smell like that normally. It's a KFC spot. I can smell it. Oh, well, also the, like... I can get two oh, you get two! Oh! All right, we got strats. I did not know that. Oh, you know what this it means, It changes Aaron. fucking everything. My fart improved your luck. What if you can get three? I have to fart more. Can't fault these fucking logic, to be honest. Yeah, man. All right, look, you, you've got five and you've got 20 seconds to go, so there's absolutely no excuse. If you fuck this up, I'm going to... Okay. I'm going to cut absolute sick. I'm going to drop my fucking guts furiously. Oh, Why am oh. I, like, getting all the fucking long-distance sheep now? Oh, shit. Right, you I need more jiggy. sheep puns. Nothing to banjo is, bro. Yeah. Oh, my own, oh my. We can't get under the door. So is there any way we can plug these fucking things in now that we've got a lot of them? Because it feels like you've got a lot of them. There's another molehill somewhere in this area that we need to find. We'll give us the last oh, move. I this heard Muse hiding under that truck. That... Come here, you fuckhead. How many chickens do we have to find? Oh. Five. Uh. Huh. What's that about? Oh, nothing. Great. Hmm. What we need, Kazooie? Damn you, Kazooie. Where are you? Hey, fuck Kazoo face. A Kazooie Kazobo. See, that looks like I should be able to jump on that. Yeah, no, Do it really does. Oh, all right. Uh, that makes <laughs> fucking buckets of sense. What am I looking at? All right. Well, there's another fucking... Whatever that thing's called. Chicken! I've been eating them all day. How do I not remember this? There's a tractor. I eat those less frequently. They provide a what? much. How the fuck did you. Huh? I don't know. You just. It, I keep thinking you're on a level and you're not. And it, it's buggering my brain. You've got like. He's got to teach you some new shit. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Make like limp biscuit and keep rolling. Rolling. I want rolling. you to listen very carefully to the next switch. That made a noise. And that was a very weird noise for a switch. Makes me uncomfortable. Ready? Oh, ping. It? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh. All right. 
Bongo sounds like a Glaswegian term for cum. Ew. It's driven with Congo. Bongo. Sorry. Are we supposed to be fighting them? Hit him. Smack him in the dick. Oh, Ooh. Jesus. He's got Blanca. Okay, so you can't. All right. Not a very good science fighter. Got like what one of the TVs give you in Sonic. Get him, get him. Yeah. Hmm. You got the wham. Wham. They come, do they have like hamster balls that you can put kids in? Yeah. Zorb Sweet. things, aren't they? Well, I know they're Zorbs, but I mean like more of an actual hamster ball. Ah. Oh. I don't know, maybe mm. lock. I reckon we could fashion one. <laughs> oh, I've been hitting the head too many times. Bad case of the fucking CTE. Oh, fuck yeah. An uh, alien skull. A skull. Sweet. <laughs> ah, you wee bird. Let me cover you in McClungo. I expect Down. to see that shit popping up on fucking Scot Scottish people Twitter. We have to be followed by some Scots. We're very popular with the underwhites. Lordy, it's warm in here. Sweating like Klungo. Better out than in. Uh, hmm. Okay. Like, if I got high, I could absolutely listen to Mumbo talk for like just 45 minutes. <laughs> hey, what's he doing for you? Okay, he's giving you the power of rats. Oh, okay. Yeah. Now I am the rat. Can you change like on the fly? Yeah. That fucking sucks. <laughs> Reminds me of that stupid rat transformer from fucking Beast Wars. What's his name? I <laughs> nibble him. No, it does not look like it. No. Okay, I gotta look up the cast of Beast Wars now. Stop it. Oh fuck yeah! What am I doing in this um, level? It's nearly done. Beast Wars. This one was oh, just like a Beast Wars. I'll see who's there. I can't remember his name because he went through different iterations. He was like Scooty Rat or some shit. Rat Trap, that's it. Cheetor. Dinobot was just called Dinobot. You know what? Like, as much as like Transformers that are animals is kind of fucking stupid, Beast Wars was a really good show. And it had a fairly badass fucking like theme. Yeah. Watched a lot of Beast Wars. Hmm. Is Cheetor a bumblebee? That's a question. People what? also ask, is Cheetor a bumblebee? What's the answer here? Go with a no. Okay. No, this so they're like Bumblebee the Transformer, not a Bumblebee the fucking animal Bumblebee. Ah, Listen to this okay. fucking answer from the fucking Transformers thread. Cheetor started off as with a personality somewhat similar to Bumblebee. They both had personalities similar to a child. In season three, after Cheetor went through, in quotes, cyber puberty, his personality became more like Hot Rod. That's unfortunate. Oh, there's a Beast Wars on Spotify. I gotta look that up. Is this soundtrack? I hope. They have a movie? I don't think so. Oh, I've only found four of your filthy children. <laughs> I was gonna keep eating. I'm eating your rat, your shit, Mumbo. 
You're going to regret turning me into a mouse now. Fucking nibbling your lava lamp. How you like it? Fucking. Am I coming to your house? Nibble your shit! Keep It Classy is proudly sponsored completely by its fans. We thank you for your support. It expanded somehow. I'll have you know...